Good evening, I'm Scott Hennessy. And I'm Melissa Mahan. Thanks for joining us. A huge event is rolling through the Central Coast over the next couple of days, and they're peddling for a good cause. KCOY 12's Dave Alley is live in Santa Maria to tell us why there are so many bicyclists in the area. Hi, Dave. There are indeed a lot of bicyclists in the area, Melissa and Scott. We're here live at Prescott Park at the north end of the city. A lot of activity, as you see, I can see uh, right behind me, also off to my left, cyclists coming in as we speak right now. And, you know, for the most part, they're all smiles. They just biked 88 miles from Paso Robles, but everyone coming in in a good mood, ready to obviously relax and have a good time tonight. Now, they're all taking part this week in the AIDS Life Cycle. It's an annual event that attracts cyclists. All these cyclists, they're from nearly every U.S. state and also from all over the world. By the hundreds and into the thousands, bicyclists are here passing through the Central Coast. It is a spectacle. It's, it's fun to see uh, people's jaws drop when we go by, when they realize that we just, are keep, we just keep coming. They're all on a week-long, 545-mile journey riding from San Francisco to Los Angeles. And they're doing this all in the fight against HIV and AIDS. For Max Sandoval of Honolulu, this is his first time here. HIV positive for nine years, his ride is personal. I've been very blessed to have my health, um, and I wanted to give back show my support to all of those living with HIV and to prevent um, the spread of HIV and increase HIV and AIDS awareness. The Life Cycle Ride is the world's largest annual fundraiser for AIDS and HIV, raising millions of dollars each year. All that money is supporting the San Francisco AIDS Foundation as well as the HIV and AIDS-related services of the Los Angeles LGBT Center. Welcome, welcome. Come get some ice, Thank get you. some water. During the course of the ride, cyclists say they feel what's called the love. Bubble. Oh my gosh, it's a week of people, Dave, treating each other like we should. Respectful, polite, friendly, no one passes you by if you need help with something. This is how people should live every day. Take care. <laughs> Thanks. And perhaps one day, the pedaling here will help find a cure. And that's certainly the goal of all these cyclists. Now, as mentioned, they started this morning at the Paso Robles Event Center came south here to Santa Maria. They're going to stay the night here at Prescott Park. I mean, this is literally behind us. It's an absolute city onto itself right now. They're all going to stay the night right here at Prescott Park. Now they're going to get a little bit of a, a shorter ride tomorrow. They're going to come, go from here in Santa Maria down to Lompoc, stay the night there at Ryan Park. That's tomorrow. Then on Friday, they'll leave uh, they'll leave Lompoc, travel to Ventura before finishing up this seven-day, 545-mile trek to Los Angeles. That will be on Saturday. Reporting live here in Santa Maria right now, Dave Valley, KCOY 12, Central Coast News.